Hi everyone, good morning. I just wanted to give you a really quick reminder that when you're doing your packback questions, make sure that you're satisfying your curiosity points. In order to get full credit, your curiosity points need to be at least 60. So I'm gonna show you how to check that really quick. From our main page, go over here to packback questions. And I say our main page, I'm teaching several courses that use Packback. So if you're seeing this message and you're in Psych 132, you're still in the right place. I'm just using my Psych 101 as my sample for this. Um, but anyway, come over here to your Packback questions. When you click, it's going to bring up your Packback page. I have this turned on anonymous so that you can't see, you know, the names of people who've submitted. But when you look at your questions, you're going to see a curiosity score. It's this number right down here. In order to get full credit, that, or in order to get any credit for your post, actually, that number needs to be at least 60. So you can increase it by doing a longer post, by doing more details. Um, so here's a couple really great posts we've had so far this week. Great job to, to the two of you who submitted these two. There's a few other really great ones, um, but so here's how, here's how you see what your curiosity number is. And just a reminder, as you're making a response, so let me do, like if I were to write my own, my own, and you can edit once you've made your question, and I'll, I'll get you to that in just a minute. But just a reminder, as you're writing your question, I need to write a sample question, and it is very early in the morning, and I'm making typos all over the place. But as you're down here, and as I'm adding my train of thought in this box, once you get to at least 250 words, it's going to start doing an analysis for you. So right up here in this corner, you're going to see an expectation of what your curiosity score should be before you even submit it. And so it can tell you, add more detail, cite a source, maybe add some media to your post. So it's going to give you tips on how to get that score higher. Now, if I go back, I do believe that you can edit a question once you've already asked. Let me see. my So my post is right here. I wonder if I can edit. Let's see. So I can. So I can click right on here. I can edit my own post. So you can go in. You can do your edits and you can try to get your curiosity score higher to where it needs to be. So there's a quick reminder about what it is exactly that you're looking for with your pack back questions and the goal that you're trying to get to to get your points for the week. Definitely feel free to send me an email if you have any additional questions about this. I will talk to you all soon.